So, Kelvin, thanks so much for having me here today. Uh, pleasure being here, Will. We are here to chat about blockchain today. Um, what is the urgency in which the security uh, of blockchain could be useful for? It's the future of our industry, massively on security. For the first time, we can actually make a digital twin of a diamond. People will now be able to independently verify an uncopyable QR code. It gives them a lot of trust in the uh, in the consumer-facing world. <laughs> it's amazing. What you showed me was amazing. It's so clean, it's so crisp, and you recognize it immediately. You think it's under the blockchain, you know? What better way of doing The nano lasering. Uh, could you tell a bit more about that and the process? They've gone into nanotechnology so they can engrave certain marks on the girdle of a diamond. So to the naked eye, it's not there. But then with you know a magnifier, that can be recognized. Linked on to the QR code, the blockchain, that's going to be easy for police, you know, the pawn shops, you know, the cash for gold material. If you steal a diamond and you don't see that there's any marks on it, you might have the idea that you will be able to sell it. Mm -hmm. And with the right tools available to the police and pawn shops, it will actually make a difference. Do you think that at some point this will actually become the norm, make more valuable objects unique this way? Absolutely. You watch, for example, if you've got a nano mark on that watch which you can't see, you've got traceability of that, of that piece as well. The nano lasers are top of the line high end uh, technology. It's really cool to see these two completely different technologies come together in a way that people understand. I'm super impressed. Uh, I really look forward to seeing the nano, uh, the nano laser. When well, you say you want to see it, how are you going to see it?